Again, keeping in view that the gallbladder has many different anatomical variations. The most uh, ideal place to see the gallbladder in a while patient is lying supine is the intercostal, right intercostal approach. Usually in the sixth or seventh intercostal space. Place the probe in the sixth or seventh intercostal space and then you may have to angle it towards the patient's left shoulder. Okay. Place the probe in the patient's spine. Place the probe in the sixth or seventh intercostal space. Go along the intercostal space and if required, angle it towards the patient's left side. By doing so, you will be seeing this image. In this case, this is the gallbladder, this is the otorwin, and you can see that the otorwin is at right, this is the neck of the GB, and otorwin is at right angles to the neck of the GB. This is the interior wall of the gallbladder. This is the interior wall of the gallbladder. This is the fundus of the gallbladder. This is the posterior wall of the gallbladder. This is the neck of the gallbladder. This is the body of the gallbladder. So, to show you the scanning plan once again, I am in the intercostal space with patient lying supine and angling the probe towards the left and coming down a bit to get as much of the gallbladder as I can. So this view I get with this probe maneuvering the gallbladder and, and total weight at right angles to its neck region. 